WFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this Monday, the 6th of March. And we're looking at the Dow at uh, the 10 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update up 59 points at 33,450. Absolutely a fabulous two days we had Thursday and Friday. Um, not complaining since uh, for subscribers, we've been long since early Wednesday morning. But this is what's uh, Thursday, Friday, Thursday, early Thursday morning. So no, I think it was, it was Wednesday. And now what we're looking at is this follow through was really important because what it does is starts to improve the MACD and the stochastic. I do expect some kind of give back of the last hour's gain. And then we'll see what happens for the close. Looking at the S&P, the S&P is also up quite nicely. It's up uh, 11 points, 12 points at 4,057. Uh, this is also good action after two fabulous sessions on Thursday and Friday. We're looking at the QQQ, NDX 100 trading vehicle, right in the Chapman Wave inside track repellent zone, up $1.52 at 301.22, actually leading the pace in terms of the percentage gains. Looking at the IWM, the IWM is the small caps, the Russell 2000, down a little bit, down 77 cents to 190.72. Now, gold. I uh, had a good couple of days, and now it's pulling back just a little bit. It's it's off the high of the day at 1864. It's trading at 1856. Looking at the dollar, the dollar's attempting, or it was earlier on, attempting some kind of rally, but it's not doing well. It's down eight ticks at 104.46. Stuck in a range. I'm still expecting some kind of a, a test of the 105. I think I said 105. 47. Anyway, it needs to make a leg D in the daily chart. That's the fourth highest peak. Looking at the bonds now, this is going to be absolutely important because bonds did have a fabulous, a strong session on Friday. Today's trying, but it's kind of giving back some. It's up 5.30 seconds, but this helps uh, the yields pull back and they need to pull back here to keep supporting the market and looking at crude oil before we go to my tiger technicians hour coming up in a couple of minutes uh, crude oil is down 53 cents 79.85 i think it's just stuck in a range i'll be back for the tiger technicians hour and check out my opening call my daily newsletter see you in a few and have a great say great programming here all day don't forget we kick it off at nine o'clock with market kickoff with tommy o'brien we'll